Hello gamers, I'm Mertuari and welcome back to Let's Talk Gaming and today we are having a look at a brand new game, a game called Vikings Wolves of Midgard and yeah, I will be discovering the game with you, so I'm currently in character creation. There have there are two options, you can choose between a shield maiden and a warrior. Now I quite like the shield maiden actually. There is some character customization like hairs. Oh, this looks nice. Hold on a sec, I could turn it earlier. Why can't I turn it anymore? Uh, yeah. What it has in... Let's pick something. Doesn't really matter all that much. This looks nice. Jewelry. Yeah. Some jewelry. I want a ginger head. Yes. Tattoos. Yes, please. Oh. 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 Oh, those looks nice, actually. This one, I prefer this one. The clan symbol, no idea what that one does yet. Uh, let's look, there are a few. I quite like this one, except. And this is where you kind of choose which, uh, what class type you will play. So Tyr is the god of war, uh, which results in a hand, uh, shield, and, uh, shield and blade warrior. Shield maiden in my case, Loki. Jotun, god of trickery, yeah, god of trickery and lies, as far as I can remember, Loki. Uh, dual wielding, apparently, Loki, okay. Thor, Thor is a fierce-eyed, red-haired and red-bearded hammer-wielding god. Okay, hammer, nice, two-handed hammer. Skathi is apparently the ranger, the bow and uh, arrow, arrow and bow guy. Odin is an idle long bearded king of Aesir, god of knowledge, battle, sorcery, poetry, and runic alphabet. I think this will be something like a mage. Yeah, a staff wielding mage type thing? I don't know yet. So, uh, an actor can be used wielding a bow. This one can be used only with two handed weapons. Okay. Two handed hammers, axes, or swords. Or unarmed. Oh yeah, dual wielding or unarmed. Okay, I think I will be going with tier. Yeah, accept. Name. Uh, let's pick Mortuary. Um, num, 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 num. I think probably the most uh, most well known uh, shield maiden is Brunhilde. But yeah, I think it's written. Like this. Ah, not enough. Let's just pick Mortuary. There. No family name. Uh, no, no, I didn't want a warrior. Ah, crap. Yes. Let's start all over again. I wanted a shield maiden. Why did she say a warrior? Okay, hair. Yes, I want hair. Jewelry, I want some. I want the ginger. I want those tattoos. And I want the clan symbol. This one. Accept. Tear, yes, accept. There. <laughs> Still says warrior. Okay, doesn't matter. New game. Uh, let's pick normal to start with. I have no idea how difficult it will be, but I will be discovering the game I together with you. No arrow. It flows like a river with all its whirls and torrents. Now, it flows towards icy death for all the nine worlds. War reigns in Asgard above us as the ancient conflict between the gods of Aesir and the angels of Vanir erupts once more. While below us, in Niflheim, the frost giants unleash the great ice upon the shores of Midgard. It is their vengeance. The Harbinger of Ragnarok, the end of all things. Who would have thought that Ulfong village, home to outcasts and renegades, would give rise to she who might save us all? That's me. <laughs> she who might save us all. That's me, yeah. I heard someone call my name. To earn more resources, complete hunts and challenges. Okay. The 
village had the misfortune of being in Grimnir's way. The giants had no quarrel with the Ulfung, but that was about to change. Press any button to continue. Okay. So that's my character. Defend the village. Let me first have a look. Oh, roll. Right click is roll. Left click is move. And probably clicking on mobs will attack them, I guess. You don't really have to keep holding the button. Oh, nice. Yeah, victory shall be yours. Indeed it will be. Oh, roll tutorial. Use roll to evade enemy attacks. Rolls require stamina. Equip armor and shields. Slow down the rolls. Okay. Use spacebar to roll. Or the right mouse button works as well. Something is attacking me and I have no idea what. Oh, yeah. Those things are... Buffs to your health, probably. Nothing here. Ah, I think I will like this game actually. It, uh, well, the the story setting makes me think back of Dark Age of Camelot, where I played I played on Midgard side, which is Norse inspired. So yeah. Oh, big uh, big guy. He's dead. He or she is dead. Okay. This is going pretty much okay for now. Oh, no gear. Did I actually find What? One of the giants is attacking? Why? I didn't do a thing yet. Okay, okay, okay. I need to, I need to see what's in that corner. Ah, nothing. No idea what the number one is in the top left corner yet. Oh, oh yeah, you have to... Oh, iron. Does that mean I will uh, need to be crafting stuff as well? Ooh. I got him in one go. Nice roll. So, anything else in the area? There's like a box. A box. A box. I need a box. A box with loot. Look. Oh, yeah. New, new item. Hunting bow. Picked up some money as well. I think I should be heading uh, further up the road, but apparently, yeah, I can hit uh, crates and boxes to unlock other stuff, maybe get some more loot, and I've already gotten some uh, iron, so I wonder what you will be needing that for. Praise Odin, you returned at last. Jotun raided our village, he slew the chieftain and most of our warriors. Oh, I barely escaped, but perhaps there's still hope for the Ulfung tribe. There are still a few survivors left. Slay the attackers and save the Ulfung tribe. Here, take this healing totem. The old chieftain will not need it anymore. <laughs> I hope it serves me better than it served him. <laughs> okay, humor in this game. Nice. Heal using healing totems. Healing requires healing charges and resets of the combo counter. Replenish healing charges. At the healing altar, as the adventure unfolds, you will discover stronger healing totems. So the tab key is the healing thing. Okay. Yeah. I got it. Checkpoint reached. Ooh, they are attacking the house. So let's let's kick them. Let's kick them out. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Oh yeah, they are hiding in there. So I have to do the killing while they they are. I, oof. That one scared me, actually. It really did scare me. Oh, what's there? What, what's happening? Oh, they are attacking my friend. No, no. Let me hurry back up there and... What did I do? 
Yeah, get to the meat hole. The meat hole is that uh, big, big house here. So that's the meat hole. Here is a meat hole. No, it isn't. I thought this would <laughs> would be the meat hole. Okay, I have to protect that uh, NPC, I think. I don't know from what yet, but why is he running? Well, he's helping. Nice. The meat hole isn't up here. The meat hole isn't up there. Nothing here. There is stuff that up there, though. Look, gold. Give me the money. Give me the money. Oh, wood and gold. No, it's not money, actually. Iron skulls. I need three iron skulls. I can see that from the top of there. Top right corner. I have no idea where to get the iron skulls, but we will, we will see once we get there. Uh, nothing in here? No? Nothing? Yeah, yeah. Let's have the lady. I can do that. There, done. Meet the, meet the survivors in the meat hall. Okay. Kill the Jotun. Oh, there he is. There he is. The Jotun is coming. I got it? Yes, I did get it. So now I have to go to the mead hall, which is right up here, I think. Yeah, I'm in the mead hall. Okay, that's me clicking. I finished a task, a job, a quest, apparently. They met that day to choose a new chieftain, but there could be only one choice. The shield maiden who had slain a giant and even driven the enemy into flight. That's me. <laughs> That's me again. Heavy armor increases the cooldown of your skills. Okay. Under the command of the new chieftain, they rebuilt the village. First, they rebuilt the altars, where the clan could dedicate the blood they had spilled to the gods and goddesses of Asgard and earn their favor. Nearby, a tent to house the Scald, who would salve their wounds and write poems of their glorious victories. Last, they rebuilt the armory and smithy, so that their new chieftain might have weapons and armor to aid her in battle. But where to take the battle? That was for the chieftain alone to decide. Yeah, where to take the battle? Let's you have, have look. yourself in battle, my chieftain. But if you're to survive this winter and against strong foes, you'll need better protection. I don't have much to offer right now, but help yourself to what I have in the smithy. Many great warriors died today. May they feast well in Valhalla. However, our stocks are ruined, meaning we cannot <laughs> feast as well here. There is meat and wood in the fjords. I will make it safe for those who lack my talents. Ah, not guilty, Chapter two. I okay. It might be interesting. I think, I think I will be wrapping up today's episode right here. Actually, since we finished chapter one, probably the introduction. It's a nice spot to uh, stop for today. I have to say, I I, I kind of like it already. It's uh, It makes me think a little bit of uh, a Diablo 3 clone, a uh, top-down version of a hack and slasher with some questing and uh, probably some crafting because I have picked up some wood and metal as well. So I will be looking forward to that. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button. And if you have comments or suggestions, you can post those in the comment section below the video. And and uh, while you are there, check out the description where you find links to my social media pages, links to the Patreon page, and links to the other crazy folks and creative misses guys. And yeah, feel free to also subscribe to the channel. Not only do you help me reach my next subscriber goal, but you will also get notified when I post new content to the channel. 
Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to record an outro, <laughs> lady. Hold on for a minute. Well, anyway, that's gonna wrap up today's episode. Until next time, have fun and stay safe. Bye.